Hello and welcome back to another computer sluggish video. Today we're going to be testing out a couple of free cleaning programs for Windows. We're going to be seeing which one that can find the most rubbish on our computer the fastest and which one can also detect the most rubbish on our computer. And to start things off we're going to be testing out Slim Cleaner. As you can see I've got everything selected on all these tabs. And we're going to now go ahead and hit analyze and just see how much junk Slim Cleaner detects. And straight away, as you can see, that was really fast. It done it whilst I was talking still. It managed to find in 0.297 seconds, it managed to find 2.7 gig of rubbish on my machine, which is a fantastic kickoff for the start of this video. That was really lightning fast. It's time to try out our next cleaning program. And next up, we have CCleaner. And straight away, as you can see, there is a lot more checkboxes to be ticked. But that don't always mean that it's going to find more rubbish on my machine. I'm going to go ahead now and hit Analyze. And let's just see how fast CCleaner analyzes all the chunk on my computer and how much it finds. And straight away, as you can see, it done it in 2.3 seconds. That is really fast. And it's managed to find a 4.4 gig of rubbish to be removed. And next up, we have Wise Disk Cleaner 9. And straight away, as you can see, there's not as many checkboxes to be selected. It's actually quite basic which is sometimes a nice feel to a program because it's just so straightforward. Let's go ahead and hit scan and see how fast wise disk cleaner finds the rubbish on our machine and also how much it actually does find. And straight away, as we can see, it's managed to find 3.5 gig of rubbish on our machine. And it actually done it really fast. It didn't take too long. There is no time, so I can't tell you exactly how fast it did do it. But it was still only about 10 or 12 seconds. And next up, we have System Ninja. This is a great, fantastic little program. As straight away, you can see, it's nicely laid out. Everything's really simple and basic. It is a program that I've not actually done a video on before, but I have used it a couple of times in the past. It's time to see how well it does compete against the other programs. Let's scan for some junk. Also, straight away, as you can see, we can select our other hard drives, which you didn't get the option in the other programs, but a lot of them do automatically detect your other hard drives anyway. But we're going to go ahead and select the other two hard drives I have. Let's go ahead and hit continue. And as we can see, System Ninja has managed to find 3.7 gig of rubbish. That's 6,572 files. It doesn't tell us how long it managed to do that in, but it has been the longest so far. It did actually take a little while for it to detect all of that. I did actually leave my desk and left it scanning, which I didn't do with the other cleaning programs. And last but not least, we have Glary Utilities. First, you need to boot up the program and you'll end up with a screen that looks like this. Then you need to click on this little disk cleanup button here. And here it is. Straight away, as you can see, it's done a scan. And that was really fast. I mean, that was extremely fast. And it managed to detect 2.92 gig of rubbish. But we haven't selected everything yet. Let's go ahead now and select everything. Let's just make sure it's all done. There we go. Right, that is everything. I'm happy with that. Everything is now selected. Let's go ahead and do a rescan and just see how fast it can scan and how much rubbish it can detect. And straight away, as you can see, it's detected 3.21 gig of rubbish. That is 1,011 files. And I'm not even going to fast forward that bit of the video because it was so fast at scanning. That was really quick, probably the fastest so far. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.